Hey everybody, how's it going? Today I'm going to be teaching you a quick way to change your Mii's name with a cheat code that lets you put it in any language you like. For example, Japanese, Korean, Chinese, with any special characters, as long as you could get a hex format of it, it'd be, it can be done. So here's what you do, you're going to have to get Code Manager, or you could do it straight from Gecko Code's website, I'll show you in a second. First we gotta have modified the XXXX, which the first me that you've ever created will be this value right here, 14A6. So we'll replace that with 14A6. And then if you want to go into the second me and so forth, you have to add 4A. So this would be your second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, seventh, eighth etc 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 okay now for the ZZZ we're gonna have to convert uh, ASCII text to hexadecimal which can be done very easily online let's look one up really quick ASCII to hex uh, let's see which one is good I don't even know we'll just pick this one okay seems good here we're gonna put in whatever text you'd like. So I'll just put in a Japanese text. Uh, I don't know how about um. There, Kuratomi. Okay, here's your hex. And now you have to go to the ZZZZ and copy paste, which can be done here. Uh, you don't want to copy the percent signs, remember that, because those aren't even hex things. Now, mine might be a little short. I think it'd be faster to type it, but whatever. So if you have more than r enough room, you might have this left over. If you do have this left over, you can delete it. So let's just get rid of this. You don't want to get rid of this line because it requires this code right here, the 000. So if you're done with the code, you're just going to replace these Z's with zeros as well. Eight zeros. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Pure zeros. Okay, that's the code. Also, if you don't have... Uh, the code manager, you could always do it right here. Just pick a... Here, me channel... GCT download, uh, I'm sorry, uh, add a codes and you click on edit or add more codes, whichever you want. So, since this is my code complete, we'll just exit this, edit, copy paste, apply, download GC, I'm sorry, I uh, check it first, GCT, save it. Now, just put that file to your SD card in the codes folder. Codes. And that's it. Now, I'll show you really quick how to do it, what to do on your Wii. Just give me one moment. Okay. Once you're ready, with the code on your SD card, just put it in your Wii. Of course, you're gonna need a homebrew channel to launch Gecko OS. Now, once this loads, you wanna make sure that SD cheats is set to yes. It should be by default. And launch channel. Scroll down to the Me channel. While it's loading, let me tell you a couple things. All you have to do is click on the the first me we made, which mine was this one. That says Gritchy. My name is Glitch, by the way. Or my alias. So you're gonna go here. Now here it says Kuratomi, like we made on the website. That's good. Now we want to click quit. Save and quit. 
And you're done. Now your Wii is named to whatever you made it, Kuratomi. Now, about this little trick, it can be transferred to your 3DS and your Wii U. And it works perfectly, I've tried it on mine. If it didn't work, I wouldn't be saying this. So I do recommend going through the Wii first. I mean... Yeah, it's good to do it through the Wii first. And then you could just send it to your Wii U or your 3DS. Really simple. Uh, I hope you understood. I'm sorry I cannot speak English very well. Uh, I hope you enjoyed and have a nice day.